Hey babes, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to mattify any lipstick, make any sheen or satin finish lipstick into a matte. Today I'm wearing the Rimmel Lasting Finish Lipstick in Asia, which is one of my favourites, but it's got a sheen finish and I personally prefer matte finish lipsticks and I am wearing it right now and it's usually got a sheen finish, but I turn it matte. And I prefer any matte finish lipstick over any other finish because it lasts so much longer. You can kiss with it and it doesn't transfer. You can eat with this and there's only going to be a fraction of the lip colour that is erased. This method lasts for hours, I've been doing it for years and I believe that this method is going to change the way that you put on your lipstick. This is going to change your makeup life if you love matte lipsticks as much as I do. And this method is so easy, okay? What you're gonna need is your lipstick and talcum powder. You can get this powder from any drugstore. It comes really cheap. I think I bought this for less than a pound in Home Bargains. I have to remind you guys, this is not going to alter any of your lipstick colors. It is a white powder, yes, but it's not gonna alter the shade of the lipstick at all, I promise you. You also need a cosmetic sponge. You can use the pound ones that you get off Poundland or Boots, those cosmetic wedges. Save those and use it for this method because they are amazing for that and I'm just using this beauty sponge that I got from TK Maxx. You wanna make sure that your lips are well moisturized, well exfoliated so that there's no any dead skin patches on your lips. My lips aren't in the best condition right now because it's winter time and no matter how much I exfoliate and moisturize my lips, they still have a little bit of texture to them. You also wanna make sure that there's no lip balm residue on your lips. So wipe that off and now you're ready to start. The first lipstick that I'm gonna be showing you is MUA Shade 13 and this is a sheen red lipstick and I'm gonna show you how to turn this from a sheen red lipstick to a MAC Matte Ruby Woo style lipstick. So just apply this perfectly onto your lips. Once you've perfectly applied your lipstick, you want to tip talcum powder, oh, it's not even open. You want to tip talcum powder into a container or the palm of your hand. You want to saturate the sponge in the talcum powder. You don't want to use like a little bit of powder, you want to use a lot. Just use a lot. And I learned this method originally years ago from Beeson Nation. Thanks babe, because honestly I've been using this technique for years and it's all because of her. So once you've got your sponge saturated in the powder, you want to pat that all over the lips. You want to stretch your lips out to cover up all of the crevices because you want all of the lipstick to be saturated in the powder. Anyway, if you get any of the powder onto the skin, just wipe that away with your finger and just use your lips and your fingers to blend away that powder. So this is the Sheen Lipstick Mattified. I love this finish so much. You can kiss your lips and there's no transfer onto the back of your hand. And now I'm going to be showing you a load of different colors so that you can see that you can use any sheen lipstick with this and mattify any of them. This is Rimmel Lasting Finish Lipstick in Asia. Another tip as well, you don't want to use a brush for this method. You want to use a sponge because I've done it before with a brush and honestly some of the lipstick does transfer onto the brush that you're using whether it be a foundation brush or a powder brush like this and lipstick on a brush is really really hard to remove so never ever use a brush. The next lipstick that I'm going to be showing you is Girl About Town from MAC which is a bright pink colour. The next one is Gosh Velvet Touch Lipstick in Twilight. And 
the last lipstick that I'm going to be mattifying for you guys is Topshop Lipstick in Innocent. My lips are on fire. So guys, that is the end of the video. And if you end up doing this method, yeah, please tag me on Instagram with a photo of you to see how you turned your sheen lipsticks into matte lipstick. I wanna see you rocking your favorite lipsticks in a matte finish. Don't be a stranger and subscribe to this YouTube channel so that we get to spend a bit more time together. I'll tell you some makeup tips and you can talk to me in the comment section and then we'll build a good YouTuber to subscribe a relationship. Um, <laughs> uh, bye guys.